CBS's Jason Allen is 200 miles up the coast in Crawfordville, Florida, close to where Helene will make landfill. And what are you seeing where you are, Jason? Good evening, Nora. We have steady rain now here in Crawfordville and the wind is increasingly gusty. The storm still about 100 miles or so to our south, so we know conditions are only going to continue to deteriorate over the next few hours. You don't see water behind me like you did where Manny is. The reason is because we're about two and a half to three miles away from the water, and that's because we feel this is as close as we can safely be. With that storm surge, it's enough to push this many miles inland. That would cut off any escape routes here on the roads. And Governor Ron DeSantis had a message for people today who might still be thinking it's, there's time to get out on the road tonight. But, but don't put yourself at risk. We have fatalities on the roadways in hazardous conditions, almost every storm, and, and those can be avoidable. The sheriff of this county warned people that an intersection just down the road from us could end up under nine feet of water. And Nora, in a neighboring county just around the bend, the sheriff's department asked people to send in their names if they were staying, their pictures, even write their names on their limbs in case there are any casualties. So dangerous, Jason Allen. You stay safe as well. Thank you.